So here I have my piece. I'm going to sprue this um, for casting. This piece will eventually go over this copper brick stone and then we'll be casting it. So for now I'll take the stone away and uh, here's my sprue wax. So I'm going to measure two pieces to fit here and here. That's where we'll begin. And then I'll cut those. I'll start with this one. And then usually holding it upside down to support it works temporarily. The pink wax is much softer than the blue wax. So here I'm just going to cut some pieces to start with to melt to put my fillets on. And here I have a wax tool, very hot, um, this electric wax pen. And so I'm just going to touch, touch the wax and it melts very quickly. And then I'm going to build that all around. So I'm going to grab my other piece. And then I'm going to flip that and melt that around here so that it fillets. And we'll start it over again. And just touch that very carefully. it hardens. It's a very soft wax, like I said. Um, so I'm going to scrape some of this off because I don't want that in my design. And I'll start here. All the way around. so that when the vacuum pulls, it will go to all sections. So a sprue is the channel of which the metal, melted metal flow, flows through. So we have the first one attached. I'm gonna set this aside. And then I'm going to cut another piece. I figure you can always go smaller. You can never go, but it's a, easier to go smaller than it is to go bigger. So I could eventually cut these sprues and trim them down to make them a little smaller. So I'm going to set another one here right beside it, if you can see, right here. But first I'm going to cut a few pieces of this to use to melt. And one more. And then, once again, bring my start here. Support that. And then bring my electric wax pen over and start this process again. So, like I said, this, this pink wax, the sprue wax, melts pretty quickly. You could also do this with an alcohol lamp and a heated tool. So once these, this is a dental tool, and you could put this in your alcohol lamp, which is out of the picture. Hold this up here and heat it and slowly work it around the same as I did with the electric wax pen. I'm going to set that back aside and then I'm going to gently squeeze these together and I think I'm going to make these a hair bit shorter. Trim that off like so. And I'm just going to clean some of this up just a little bit. 
where I inadvertently melted some sprue wax onto my design. And then I'm going to make sure these are attached together by melting some, some wax right there. And there you have your sprued, sprued piece. And then we will now, the next step is to weigh this so we know how much metal we have to use.